work most nights. Not why I did it, but I can't say that. You've been working the been nights. Last week I did. We are here, as you maybe maybe can see from the title. We're gonna watch the two latest Studio C episodes. Pretty soon you'll get tired of us watching back-to-back -back Studio C episodes, so we'll try to be on time. I mean, if you like that sort of thing. Who likes to be on time? He certainly doesn't. Right, Dylan? These two new Studio C episodes. Uh, mm, my cup over here. Um, I'll get it during the theme. Oh, wait, gotta turn it up. Let's offer one more round of applause for oh. that beautiful performance from the string quartet. String quartet? Yeah! That was lovely. Now, without further ado, the same day has arrived for each graduating senior to come up and accept their diploma. And according to tradition, the names are always read by the university's founder, Clark M. Richards. <laughs> <laughs> so the university must not be very old. Unless he's just like Mr. Ecclestone old. I haven't seen his No, he doesn't even look that old. Congratulations to the graduating class of 2014. Steve Jenkins. Oh, Jefferson. Yes. Okay. Cheryl. Shirley. Shirley. Whoa. Walters. Shirley Withers. Walters. Shirley Waffles. <laughs> Congratulations, Shirley Falafel. <laughs> His nose. <laughs> Smurf Magoosh. Sam McKenzie. <laughs> Flub dub <laughs> Baggins. Fra Francis Benson. <laughs> John Stamos. John Stamos is here. Do you need your glasses? That was Jeff Simon. Yeah. I don't know who that is, but. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Obviously, it's someone. Okay, here we go. There you go. Hermina. Hey, Macarena, Macarena. <laughs> I'm like, hey, uh, Shamu. Nope. Shamu. <laughs> nope. Shamu is the name of a whale, not a person. <laughs> Shamu Franklin. Oh, Shamu. Oh. What? Oh. Stacy. Come on, face. Shut up, slap. Oh, Shamu. Oh, Shamu. Oh, Shamu. Oh, Shamu. Profiling. 
but that was actually what he was wearing. Okay, Peter, so not everything is one color and another color. You mean black and white. I am this close to taking your badge. Now read the report back to me, but without all the offensive parts. Hey, there's nothing offensive in here, but I have a search request out for a person with an accent from somewhere else. Good. And he is wearing a traditional hat from a culture. <laughs> he is also six feet tall. Whoa! Can't say that either. That's offensive to Europeans. What? They use the metric system. <laughs> hey, look, it's, I find it best to just compare people to the height of other things. Are they as tall as a tree? or as short as a smaller tree. <laughs> that doesn't mean anything. That could be a billion different people. Great. We've narrowed it down by six billion people. OK, OK, let's say that I need to file a report on a 45-year-old female nah, gun dealer. No, no, you can't say female sexism. What if it turns out she's a man with very feminine legs? I'm like that. Wow. Oh. See? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, so I have to say a 45-year-old hourglass-shaped form? Yeah, but be careful how you say 45. You made it sound like you thought that was old. Make it more celebratory. 45! But not like it's better than any other age. 45. Perfect. <laughs> hey, Captain. Yeah? Update on the bank robbery case. Yeah? We're going to need a warrant out for a juniper bush height thing with a nice face who dresses fancy. Yeah, and everyone be on the lookout for a human being wearing pants? Last seen at a store that specializes in things that some people like, other people don't, and that's okay. Yeah. <laughs> See, Hanson and Watts got the memo. Well, good luck, guys. You'll get him, or her, or it. Thanks, Captain. <laughs> those sentences said nothing about anyone. Yeah, for all we know, one of those warrants could be for you. Yeah. What? Yeah, you could be the size of a juniper bush. Uh, clearly, I'm the size of a Douglas fir. <laughs> Look, people, this is the world we live in now. Okay? So get your skins of various perfectly hued tones out of here and get to work. <laughs> Somebody catch that juniper bush height fancy dress thing! <laughs> hey, did you guys see that gypsy? What? Hilarious. What? <laughs> hey, sometimes the studio sees things and it feels like we were just finished. Ah, oh, it's a camera. Is that a camera? Yeah. Okay. Okay. It is a camera. Wow. It's a camera on a drill. I think. But it's actually just the camera. Okay. It's snowing. So, uh, are you doing anything this weekend? Uh, yeah. Hey, guys, check it out. I went to the flea market and I totally got this new moon ring. Uh, I'm sorry. Is it 1997 or are you an idiot? <laughs> moon rings okay. are 70s. Well, moon rings are coming back, and this one's crazy accurate. And it speaks. Listen. What? I'm feeling excited. <laughs> I am excited. Look. And yeah, why would you want a talking moon ring? Yeah. Man, it tells your moon. Come on. No, that is not a reason okay, to want. Okay, you just have to try it on. No, you and Bobby. Stacy, we're making a comment. Not to start the meeting. Just try it. Just try it. I'm feeling annoyed. Oh. <laughs> it's, it's accurate. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's, it's not coming off. Yeah, just Stacy. Stacy. No, I told you not to put it on there. Please have a seat, everyone. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, we can see where this is going. As you probably noticed Mr. Avery is not here. He uh, he passed away this past weekend. He was uh, very old but very dear to this company. I'm feeling happy. <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? I'm feeling panicked. <laughs> it was James' talking mood ring. What? I'm feeling betrayed by my secret crush. <laughs> oh, are you saying you're happy that Mr. Avery died? That man was like a father to me, James. No, no, it's very sad. I'm feeling ecstatic. Be quiet. I'm feeling romantic. Uh, he does that when it gets warm. What is going on? I'm sorry, sir. Avery was a great man, but... He always did paperwork wrong, and I always had to redo it. But that's all. It's just a little... I'm feeling lying. That's not a stupid ring. I'm feeling extremely angry and not wearing deodorant. No, no. How about we just calm down? Calm down. That was down. Fine, fine. I'm calm. I'm feeling like a little baby girl with a pretty bow on her head.
really sorry. Let's see. Okay, let's just try to move on. Um, let's go over it. shipping and receiving. Uh, lately, no, we've been no. getting um, complaints from the customers because the shipping area is... I'm um... feeling bored. <laughs> All right. Listen, you little insensitive imbecile. If you ever wear that ring in my presence ever again, even for a second, I promise you will regret it. I'm so sorry. I'm feeling romantic. <laughs> <laughs> I warned you I had a very particular set of skills. But you refused to listen. And now I'm here to tell you one last time. No one's taking anything. So take two of these. Take two of these. Oh. Could you take a picture for us? Oh, yeah. You'll take nothing. Oh, it smells like a chimpanzee's body cast. <laughs> hey, let's 
taking so long, bro? It's just a little slippery. I'll be right there. Hey, did I not let down in that bear?
sure about this? Yes. The last time you tried to break up with Jason, his mom broke my ribs oh, with her purse. Oh, Stacy. <laughs> don't worry. I don't care how guilty he makes me feel. It ends today. Okay. Your piece is in. Yes. Gloves on. Prayers offered. <laughs> Oh, hey, Mal. Hey, Jason. Uh, I need to talk to you. Yeah, I wanted to talk to you, too. Oh, quick, do it now before he says more words. Well, it's... I'm not sure that this is working out. Never mind. Let the boy speak. <laughs> you know, I, I've been thinking about it for a while now. Wait for it. And I think we should break up. <laughs> Success! I'll break out the sparkling cider. <laughs> how, how do people do this? <laughs> Okay, so you want to break up? Is cider bad for plants? I would feel bad if this shrub died. <laughs> why? Uh, because I have a heart. Wait, are you asking him why he wants to break up? I advise against this action. You know, I, I just, I, I don't feel the same way I used to about things. Good. Say, okay, wipe away a fake tear and walk away. Was it something I did? What are you doing? No, this is what you wanted and you don't even have to feel guilty about it. It's like eating non-fat yogurt. I'm just curious. Curiosity killed the cat's opportunity to get out of this relationship. <laughs> no, I just feel like we should see other people. Oh, um, is there someone specifically who you want to see? Who cares? <laughs> you don't want to date him. Yes, but I don't want anyone else to date him either. <laughs> I don't understand. Are we here to break his knees or something? <laughs> No, I mean, there was this one girl that expressed a little interest, but I'm not really looking to date someone right now. No, do not ask who. Who? I hate you. <laughs> Kelly? Kelly Peterson? Kelly Peterson? He can get Kelly Peterson? Dang, boy! <laughs> Tell him congratulations. <laughs> yeah, I think so. Do you know her? If you do know her, will you set me up? Because that girl is... I want to talk about cheese. <laughs> I don't want to break up. How are those words escaping your mouth hole? Oh, I don't know, Mal. Good, Jason, good. Now slowly reel her back in. <gasps> it's a trap. Go away, Matt. No, no, butterfly, come in. You're being played. Good. Now tell her that you're not sure that this is a good idea. That will drive her crazy. After that, tell her that your mom has forbid you two from dating. People cannot resist what they're told they can't have. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Let me get my cake real quick. Uh, uh, hey, Jason. This is, uh, your black friend hiding in the bushes. Uh, listen, I... <laughs> I think we need to take a different approach. Tell her that you want to stay together. You know, now that we've talked about it, I think we should stay together. Oh, good. Tell her you love her. I love you. Good. Like a lot. Are you sure? Oh, yeah. Like a lot. Hey. Okay. Oh, man, I think I'm losing her. Talk about your future together. And who knows what the future may hold. Future's a strong word, Jason. Is it? How many kids? How many kids do you want to have with me? Uh, marriage. Marriage! What? Leave her a kiss. What? No, 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 no. Yes, no, more of that. Yeah. What? Chop, Stop chop, chop, chop. Stop that! No, Jason, I think we should break up. You're weird. Come on, now. She reminds you of your mom. You remind me of my mom. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, bye, Jason. <laughs> that is what you get for trying to manipulate. Jason, honey, have you seen my car? You! <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
you might have told those Barbie oh, stolen oh, words. <laughs> It's a duck, it's kissing good budget. Oh, the kissing good budget. That's because she had insane little expectations. Oh, forever alone. Look at what she wrote. Look at what she wrote on her Twitter book status right before you picked her up. Goodbye, cruel world. Coach Harkey, why don't you walk us through Madame Gaspard's performance? Yeah, sure. Let's see. 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 Let's see
cameras long enough for you to free all of the test subject animals without the campus security noticing. Uh, Brian! Bubbles. Yeah. 
Jim Carrey's a liar. That's the Mona Lisa one. That's the the, the hipster band one. <laughs> What? Wait, what do you mean? That's Jason. 
she's why is Jason here? I'm Rachel. Oh yeah, that's right. I distracted the surveillance cameras long enough for you to free all of the animal test subjects without security campus knowing. Yeah, about that. Why didn't you just <laughs> Okay. Well, that was fun. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what was your favorite sketch, Dylan, uh, of the two episodes? It was either that one, last one, the breakup one, or... I like the first, the opening one of the last one. Yeah, the opening one. Shamu! Shamu! I <laughs> the whale out of her. Words. Class. All right. What should we do? Act next. Like not right now, but uh, whatever people like time and space. What are you doing tomorrow? Next, we need to. Next, we need to finish once. What about that? What's I'm the time space thing? People keep saying. Oh, adventure in time and space. I need to do that too. Oh, we need to do that. I'll. That's not. I, I watched this one scene with eleven and one. I didn't know it was from that, but I almost kind of like. Oh! I know. I will rewatch it. I didn't watch the whole thing. Just that. Hey y'all. Something. Right. Watch that next. Say goodbye, Dylan. Bye. Bye. Clouds. Clouds. Words. <laughs>